My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We've got a really high quality 1956 Chevrolet 3100 series pick em up truck. It has a pro street build. It's a high performance big block, but yet it's got air conditioning and a couple of comfy bucket seats. And as I just inspected this truck, the more and more I became impressed. The workmanship and quality is very impressive. Only 3,500 miles on the truck since it's been finished. You can go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the specs, study all the pictures. And that's where you'll find prices on all of our collector cars that we have for sale. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the videos, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. But right now, buckle up, join me, let's go for a spin. A 56 Chevrolet truck. <clears throat> yeah, so underneath the truck, uh, it's the original frame. It's been boxed. Uh, the front clip is from a 72 Impala, so it's independent suspension. It's all new, all rebuilt, all the bushings, uh, you know, spring shocks, tie rod ends, all that stuff's been replaced in the front end. The rear end is a custom setup. It's got a Ford 9-inch that's been narrowed. Uh, the tires are super wide under here. Uh, that's why we call it a Pro Street. So it's a narrowed 9-inch with uh, four link suspensions, all tubular control arms, has a diagonal pan hard bar and has coil over shocks. Uh, it's got a fat three inch exhaust, it looks like Flowmaster mufflers and they dump down about, about here so they don't go all the way out the back. Uh, the fuel tank, uh, it's a fuel injected motor so the fuel tank has the fuel pump and filters. <clears throat> uh, it's got disc brakes up front, drum and back. You look up at the motor, it's got a big capacity oil pan. Uh, the Turbo 400 has a performance rebuild with a shift kit, has an external cooler, and it has a thinned aluminum pan on the transmission. So underneath the truck is very clean, very tidy, completely solid, neatly done, you know, brake lines, fuel, just the way it's put together, it's very neatly done. The body, the truck is all metal. There's no fiberglass. And it's all new metal except the cab itself. The cab uh, is completely solid metal, no rust or damage. And everything else is new metal, so obviously no rust or damage. And it's all straight. It, no, dam, no dents, no dings. It's not wavy. It's all straight. It has a gloss white paint everywhere. In the jams, in the cab, everywhere. Smooth, glossy white paint. All new glass. I rolled up the windows. You can see it has just a slight uh, tint in the glass, but it's all new. All the gaskets, even the window frames, the vent window frames, uh, that's all been replaced. And you roll the window down, see the chrome frame around the glass is new. And all the gaskets, all that's in excellent, excellent condition. All the chrome on the truck, the door handles, the mirror, the wipers, the tail lights. Even the uh, chains for the tailgate, the front bumper, the grill, headlight bezels, that's all new. You probably notice there is no rear bumper. We want to give it a cleaner look. 15 inch weld racing wheels, they're polished. It has Mickey Thompson uh, tires all the way around. And again, I don't know how wide they are, but there's some meaty tires under there. And then the little stuff, the welting between the body and the fenders, stainless steel hardware. The door latches, it's all new stuff. The door jams painted just as nice as the outside. The screws are new, the weather strips new. It's just very, very uh, tidy and clean, like an operating room. So under the hood is a 454 big block, board 30 over. <clears throat> And it's got a YN Stealth intake with a Holley Sniper EFI electric fuel injection system. And it's polished. Uh, it has a Sniper coil with a billet distributor. Got a set of headers. Up in front, it has a billet timing cover. 
and it has the March billet bracket and pulley system with serpentine belt. Uh, it's got a, a vintage air heat and AC system. The AC compressor is a little polished compressor. You look at the door jams, the latch, it's just slick everywhere. I can see the track of the seat is gloss belt black. So the whole inside of the cab was you know, stripped, gutted. It was all painted just as smooth as glossy. It's all white with the exception of like the dash and the inserts on the doors are like a charcoal gray metallic. The tailgate opens with no problem. You just remove the chains. Uh, the bed of the, uh, the truck bed here is all refinished oak with stainless <clears throat> steel strip and hardware. The fuel was relocated to the floor and it's flush. It comes with a car cover. Also comes with these uh, extra wide wheel wells for the tires. So it's, it's that wide. Uh, so everything was painted inside. They put a custom gauge cluster in there. It has tachometer. It lights up nice and bright white. And everything inside the truck looks new. The knobs, the window cranks, the handles, the armrests. Uh, vintage air heat and AC controls. The vents are neatly under the dash. Has power brakes. Has a modern power steering with the remote reservoir. Stainless steel braided hoses. Modern alternator. Big radiator to keep it cool. It's got a custom aluminum shroud with a big electric fan. It's got an aluminum overflow bottle. Has a fuel regulator. All the wiring's new. The whole engine bay is painted gloss white. I told you earlier they painted everything. It's all slick. New hood hinges. It has retractable seat belts. Reclining bucket seats. They're very comfortable. A new carpet with matching mats. Uh, a homemade uh, wood council. He did a beautiful job. He has uh, cup holders. That's a tilt column that's in there. Everything under the dash is new. So I think it's that time here in our party where we fire it up. Seats are comfy. 3,407 miles since it's been done. Uh, overhead, it has the headliner, new visors, new <clears throat> day and night mirror. That thing makes some noise. That's why I shut my mouth. You can feel it inside. Uh, it's got a really deep throaty sound. But anyway, this is a pro street, so it's got some giddy up and go. It's got some muscle. It's got some growl. But let me tell you, the fit and finishes are excellent. It's very refined, done very well, very comfortable inside. It's got air conditioning, power steering, power brakes. You get in and drive this truck. That's my impression. You can go to volocars.com, plenty of ways on there to contact us, ask for a salesman, they'd be happy to answer questions or concerns you might have. They can also get this delivered to your driveway, they can help with financing, go to volocars.com. If you enjoy watching our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. Thanks for watching.